All right, letting the truck warm up. We found one. Uh, we're in Jacksonville, and uh, DQL had a funny email. I'll show you that real quick. <clears throat> and I'll show you the email correspondence between myself and the uh, broker that just booked this for me. Um, CH Robinson again. They're kind of, I guess, they're getting the most freight right now in the pandemic world. I don't know what's going on. Normally, I book with them like once or twice a week, maybe, and it's been like three in a row now with them. So. Um, TQL guy, he uh, he said I'm a thousand dollars over what this lane is, and, and I just said, hey man, I'm trying to make money for my family, so this is what I'm gonna be uh, able to run that for. And it was all the way down to Miami. It was 360 miles from Brunswick, which is just north of Jacksonville. So no hard feelings, but some of these brokers take it personally and act like you're crazy. But stick to your guns, like I always say. Um, we got $1,200 on 170 miles. It's heavy, but from Savannah to um, Jacksonville it's not it's flat so it's not really gonna beat the truck up at all probably get some fuel I'm up at there in Georgia because I'm uh I'm two thirds of a tank but I'd rather have some more but I don't like filling in Florida anyways let me get up there guys pick up the stuff don't know what it is it's like like a warehouse so we'll see what it is when we get there stick to your guns and they will pay all right guys later all right here we are again Worldwide Distribution Center. Two o'clock appointment. It's about 1.20. I've been here once before and they had beer last time. So let's see if I got beer again. That's definitely a heavy load on the BOL. So we're the Raycon. So we'll see. Nice people here last time. She gave me a Golden Star sticker. If it's the same lady. Let's see. Right here on the right, 100 Morgan, Morgan something Parkway, Morgan Industrial. Yeah, this is it, the beer place. All right. They need stuff moved out here though, so uh, hold your guns for your rate. I'm gonna get checked in at door 22. Finished sweeping out the trailer. This place wants it super clean. Um, it is a beer place. I'm going to Anheuser Busch, and just talked to the lady in there. Same nice lady that I've been here probably eight months ago, middle of the fall last year or so. And it's the same super nice lady that gave me like this little gold star, saying I'm a gold star driver. But um, she said this load's been rescheduled twice now. I'm the third guy, so they're having trouble booking stuff out here. So stick to your rates, get the best money, and I'm gonna get into door 23. So those are my emails this morning with TQL. I was working CH Robinson, I was working JB Hunt. I'll show you that after I'll go through my phone again like I do, show you kind of my progression with it. But uh, it was early in the morning, it was like nine o'clock I started. Um, but there's different levels of brokers. There's broker agent, there's uh, care relations guys, there's um, customer reps, all kinds of different levels. And in the beginning, you're gonna be dealing with a lot of agents and they're gonna be quick witted. They're gonna be uh, salesmen, which brokers are all salesmen. But when you get to the top of the, uh, customer reps and the carrier uh, relations reps, those guys have the power to, to pull the loads and pull the pull the, the bigger money because they need to get it moved. Like this this load had um, two dropouts already where it had to be rescheduled. So don't get frustrated in the beginning. You're, don't be, try not to be rude to them. Someone will be rude back to you and they'll try to make you feel like you're crazy for the rate you're asking, but it's your truck, it's your fuel, it's your maintenance on your truck. You don't have to break that down every time, but try and make them understand that so um, i tried a new spot out today this is the uh fish dock kind of off of brunswick see how good their food is but i've always wanted to try it but uh, a lot of bugs out of here but then again it's starting to get warm um so yeah i'll go through my progressions down here and then uh, also while i was in jacksonville i stocked up on some food and uh soft drinks and stuff for the truck and some water um, and uh, the store wasn't that picked over. I mean, you can tell they just restocked it. So well, I see Walmart trucks moving. I see a lot of stuff moving. I think that we're still in a sense of panic. It is a serious um, epidemic, but um, it's mostly for the older people, which kind of sucks. But um, Italy just had 360 confirmed deaths in one day, which is crazy. But Italy's a really smaller 
country and they're also letting people over 80 die, which is <laughs> kind of crazy. Makes it sometimes happy you live in America. They try to take care of everyone. Um, and also, what do you guys think about Tom Brady going to the Buccaneers? Uh, Don J. Hopkins le leaving um, Deshaun Watson and going over to the Cardinals. All kinds of crazy stuff going on. Um, Diggs is, is over with, uh, who's he with now? I forget who Diggs went to, but um, the NFL is just a crazy free agency. Dak Prescott got franchise tagged. Uh, Mari Cooper stayed with him, but uh, yeah. What do you think about all that kind of stuff? And uh, I'm going to check out this food. God bless you guys. Keep trucking. Wait for your rate. Should be another, this whole week should be good. I mean, until this stuff calms down, it should be good. So keep uh, getting money you're worth. I don't know about the rest of America, but uh, here in Jacksonville, Florida, uh, they're doing a pretty good job of keeping up, keeping stocked. All the yogurts, all the milks, all the eggs, frozen vegetables. Only thing I've seen here that is uh, still very depleted is bottled water. So it looks like they're getting the main stuff, all the frozen pizzas, all that aisle still full. Um, I just got some cheese get down to the meat section but um yeah they're, they're pretty stocked still i see other stores gonna be out there's the water water's out but uh soda's completely full um lunch meat is restocked but there's still a lot missing get hot dogs you can get bacon uh, toilet paper there's only like three <laughs> three bundles of it but there's still some there so i mean they're gonna be able to stay ahead of this they have chicken 
that short. We've got whole turkeys, and this is Monday. A bunch of chicken and a bunch of beef. So, Monday the 17th, and uh, looks like they're staying ahead of the curve. I don't know if it's just Jacksonville, but uh, all the baked goods and stuff is full too. And all the canned foods. Some gone, but you can tell they've stocked up again. So I don't know where this goes from here, but uh just showing you Jacksonville, Florida, because I had to get some stuff today. God bless. Hope everybody else out there is doing okay too.